month. Plus, you'll save energy. Those are some huge pluses. For details, call 436-5050 or visit PensacolaEnergy.com. Joe Morris and Son Funeral Home, located at 701 North DeVillers Street, Pensacola, Florida, was founded in 1913, and they remain locally owned and operated. They offer the same professional staff and efficient services that you have come to expect over the years. The Joe Morris family is deeply committed to providing you and your family with affordable prices and personal attention to details. They want to thank you for entrusting your loved one's final arrangements with Joe Morris and Son Funeral Home, and they want you to be assured that their obligation to your family extends far beyond the completion of one's service. Again, they want to thank you for allowing them to serve you with dignity and personal pride that comes with helping others. They're here for you, and whenever your need arrives, call Joe Morris and Son Funeral Home. Their phone number is 850 850- 432-3436. Hurricane Harvey landfalling tonight and tomorrow morning across the coastal bend of Texas, pushing inland, very torrential, historical proportions of rain, as well as tidal surge and possible tornadoes. By comparison, our, by comparison, we're going to be under high pressure that dominates and serves up an isolated thunderstorm or two possibly for the rest of the day. It's about 20, 30 percent for tonight, 30, 40 percent coming in each day, partly cloudy to cloudy Saturday, Sunday, each day's highs close to 90. Ralph Sanji, Joyce, 106.9 FM and 980 WR. All right, y'all. Seriously, now this is no joke, no joke. The at the pathway at the family center, the pathway for change. They're located at 2050 West Blunt Street. They're having their fifth annual event over there today, and uh, they got everything. They're giving away a lot of stuff over there: gift cards, bicycles, and everything. But one of the things that you might be really seriously interested in is. Uh, they got free cell phones over there, y'all, if you're eligible for it. If you own Medicaid or Medicare or government assistance or uh, whatever, okay, you are eligible for a free cell phone with 350 minutes, okay? 350 minutes. That's 350 minutes every month. Compliments of the Obama administration. Sometimes you hear, you hear them referred to as Obama phones, okay? You better get them now for that crazy-ass Trump cut it out. So you better get over there now and get your free cell phones because they, this is what you're entitled to. And they they did that program, seriously, they did that program because uh, older people and disadvantaged people and poor people could not afford a cell phone. And so the government created a program during the Obama administration so that Everybody can have access to a cell phone. And so you need to get your parents one, your grandparents one, <coughs> somebody a free cell phone. You don't have to pay these other companies for a cell phone for your parents that only use it when they need to call you to get the medication or something like that. Uh, the, these are phones are free, and you can go see Crystal or anybody over there at the Pathway for Change. They're giving away right now, y'all. They're only going to be there until about 2 o'clock today. So if you want a free cell phone, if you're eligible for it, if you join assistance, if you, you're eligible for Medicaid, if you're, in other words, if you're over 65 years old, then you automatically qualify from what I understand of the qualifications. If you're disabled or if you, uh, or if you own <coughs> government assistance otherwise or if you um, can't afford a cell phone by your own right. You're entitled to one under this program that was created by the Obama administration, so they're giving them away today. They got two or three booths over there right now giving away uh, free cell phones. 350 minutes, They can you can text and call and all those. Uh, those are good phones for... Uh, Senior citizens and children, I mean, people that eligible, just, just, just eligible for cell phones. So go get them right now and tell them the Blue Town sent you. Okay?
tell you, if you're hungry, St. Mark will give you food. If you're thirsty, St. Mark will give you drink. If you're a stranger, St. Mark will welcome you, y'all. Yes, St. Mark Community Picnic is going on right now. Is this Pastor Horace Jones? Yeah, this is Pastor Horace Jones. How you doing, Pastor? Oh, I'm doing good today. Doing good. The Lord is good, and the Lord is blessing right now. Very good. I understand y'all having your community picnic. We had free food and family fun out there today, huh? Oh, yes. We just enjoying that family fun. They just simply want to do for the community because we got to reach the Lord tonight any cost. Very good. Very good. Uh, tell me, folks have been calling me and saying, how did I get there? to uh, St. Mark. Where's Hannah Street? Some folks saying they don't know where Hannah Street is. Tell them if they come in north on Pensacola Boulevard, tell them to come all the way to Hannah, just, just north of that Insta 5 station, and tell them to take a right, and they'll come right to it. But if they get on, get on Old Palo Cross Highway, they come all the way up until they get to that Bond Street stuff, mm -hmm. and tell them to t take a right, and they'll be right here at it. So you located right between uh, 29 and Old Palafox, right? That's right. Exactly right. Okay, you know, if you, if folks, if you're coming up Highway 29, you pass, uh, I, I believe, um, uh, what's the name of the street there? Uh, Michigan. Yes, uh, yes, yes. So if you're coming up, if you're coming north, mm -hmm. if you're coming north, going, traveling north on Highway, on highway 29, mm -hmm. Come all the way until you get to Hannah. That's where you get to that Mary Lum or something. You're going to see a hardware on your right. And you turn to your right, and you'll see my church when you take that right turn on Hannah Circle. Right. Right now, turn on Hannah Circle there. Right. Okay. So y'all get, just tell me y'all get free food out there? And oh, yes. We fun. have free food. Got some good old fresh mothers that haven't been long ago out the gulf. And that is <laughs> real good. <laughs> Well, very good. And you're inviting everybody to come out there. don't have to be a church member. You, you're in and everybody can come out there, huh? Everybody come. We're trying to give them something to eat. <laughs> well, very good. Folks, get on out there to the St. Mark's Church of God in Christ. That's located at 57 East Hannah Street, y'all. And like I said, if you're coming up Highway 29, past, uh, like you're going towards Walmart, right by the fire department, right by the fire department, just turn right. If you're coming down 29, if you're coming out from Inslee or, uh, or Cantonment area, then you have to look to your left on Hannah Street there. I'm going down to the, to the circle there. Yes, sir. Sound like you're having a, sound like you're having a good time out there, Pastor. Oh, we're having a good time. It, I tell you, it's good to hang with young folks when you're 75 years old. <laughs> I know that's right. I know that's right. Now, this is Superintendent uh, Pastor Horace Jones Sr., y'all. He's a grad pastor of St. Mark's Church of God in Christ, and uh, they wanted to invite you to come on out there to help celebrate their 
annual St. Mark's picnic. They got free food and family fun for everybody going on today. How long are y'all going to be there, uh, Pastor? Yeah, we'll be until about 3 o'clock. We're going to close it down about 3 o'clock. Okay, close down about 3 I, o'clock. I want them to come to church to Sunday school in the morning. Well, okay, well, I can get off at 2 o'clock. I have to come by there and get me some free food then. Yeah, you do that. Come on yeah. by. We'll be glad to have you. I'll make them cook some good hot money. All righty then. Very good. Well, Pastor, thank you so much, and we appreciate it, and we're going to tell everybody to come on out there and join you at the Inns. This is out in the, in the big city of Inslee, y'all, the St. Mark Community Church, having their St. Mark Community Picnic. Yes, sir, with Pastor Harge on. Thank you, Pastor. Thank you. All righty. All right, y'all, go, y'all get on out there now. Tell them that the Blues Hound sent you. Yes, sir. You know, we, 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 I just played this song y'all was talking about, um, Don't Let the Clean Up Woman. You know, Betty Wright started that song about the clean up woman, and then Lacey just finished the song. She saying, but don't let the clean up woman come in and clean up, your, clean up for you. Nope, keep them out. Well, what about, that, is there a such thing as a clean up man, do you think?
clean up man, like the clean up woman, y'all. Y'all, y'all ever heard of a shot house? A shot house. You know when bootleg, when liquor is illegal, you have to when you sell bootleg liquor, you can sell it by the shot in a baby food glass or something like that. And you go to these people's house and they sell it to you in the, at the shot house. Yep, you can get a shot of liquor. Sometimes you get a shot of leg. <laughs> Y'all know what I'm talking about. I bet Dr. J.R. know what I'm talking about when I said the shot house. To the shot house. Turning up tonight, and we gon' party to the break of dawn. Gonna twerk to the left, gonna twerk to the right. Ooh, we're going hard tonight. Up on the skyline, up on Sura. It's an old school party, and it just won't stop. Let's go, baby. Shot house. Forget about that hole in the wall. I'm going to the shot house. Let's go, baby. To the shot house. All my ladies in the house tonight. Let me hear you say, oh, 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 oh. Ow, ow, ow. All my ladies in the house. You can clean up at the shot house, y'all. You can clean up at the shot house. Now I know what he was talking about. When Big Rob say the sugar shack. Gonna twerk to the left. Gonna twerk to the right.
Let's get it in. Cool to you all to sit down. Now you shouldn't be shaking like that. It's an old school party. You remember when your daddy used to go to the shot out and come home drunk? And call people yellow SOBs? I remember. as he was, he got enough nerve to call somebody that's a yellow SOB. Let's go, baby. Yeah. To the shot house. Remix. Twerk it to the left, twerk it to the right. Bring the thing on and work it all night. That's right. Just work it. Just work it, ladies. Twerk it to the left. You do, ladies. Twerk it to the left, twerk it to the right. Bring the thing over and work it all night. Let's work. Let's work. Let's work. Twerk it to the left, twerk it to the right. Bring the thing over and work it all night. I want to send this one out to my main man, Mr. Wilbert Henderson. Pensacola's own. Bobby and James Purify.
can go over and see Bishop Hackworth at Bowler's Men's Wear, y'all, in the big city of Brownsville. Tell them that the Blues House sent you. He asked you who sent you? You say the Blues House sent you. You say who is it? You say the Blues House. Yeah, the Blues House. Your story, baby. Yes, Tell it. I, I was making love to my little friend, and he forgot he was the other man. Now he don't care. I got a man. Yes, I do. And he knows I don't play no I don't game. Play no game. I don't want them talking to each other, and that's why I never say no name. He had. Sam is my man. Uh huh. This is Pensacola's own, y'all. Raven. Woo! Formerly known as Lady Ebony. <laughs> they got a great big concert coming up, y'all. It's gonna be the first annual concert, an all blues concert, y'all. It's gonna be an op. Alabama, y'all, sponsored by Miss Edna. Yes, sir. Hey, Shuka. Hey, you learning. How you do, baby? I'm good. How you still, you? you still love me. Yes, I do. Okay, very I good. I sure do. I, I hear that y'all are going to have this first annual all blue, all 
Class Blue Show in Up, Alabama on October mm -hmm. the 7th. Talk to me mm -hmm. about that, Shuka. Well, honey, let me tell you that, that if anybody has ever been to the Spring Clean, then they know how much uh, land is out there. Mm -hmm. well, this is how Up, Alabama is. This mm -hmm. is how this location is. It, it can hold up to 30,000 people. That, that's how big the uh, the area is. So there's plenty of room for you to spread out. Mm -hmm. You can bring your lawn chairs, bring your coolers. It, it's just going to be a great time. It's, um, it's going to be the first weekend in October, October the 7th. Mm -hmm. We had it set for August the 19th, <coughs> mm -hmm. excuse me, but because of uh, rain, we had to fall. Okay. Which is good because, you know, it allowed uh, the ones that was going to come on the 19th that couldn't make it, it allowed them to come on out and get these tickets so you can come on out to Op Alabama. If you don't know where Op is, it's up around the Andalusia Enterprise Dothan area. <laughs> so it's not far. You got uh, coming out of Mobile. That's going to make a stop in Pensacola. It's going to make a stop in Fort Walton Beach. It's going to make a stop in Cresby, Al uh, Florida. And it's coming on into Op Alabama. So all you got to do is just go, jump on that bus. It's only $45 to ride that bus, and I, that includes your ticket. I heard that. That's uh -huh. what he said, including so, the ticket. Yeah, that includes your ticket. So, you know, you can get on that bus, have your cooler. You don't have to worry about driving home drunk. Mm -hmm. Right. But you can have a good time. <laughs> it's only $12 there and $12 back. Wow. That's all it is. All right, That's what is $12? Right. Come on there now. Is. Come on. For it you is. to enjoy yourself, come on, get on that bus and just ride out and enjoy yourself. We got Big Yale. You mm -hmm. know, we having a cowgirl contest. I don't know if my partner told you that, but. No, he ain't talking a about a cowgirl. Yeah, but we got a cowgirl contest. What? <laughs> no, so put your little cowboy stuff on, your cowgirl stuff <laughs> on, and, you know, Mr. Big Yayo. You know, y'all know that cowgirl thing he sang? Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Uh huh. Yeah. And then uh, we got Raven Salve. You know, mm. she's going to be shaking that jelly roll yeah, for you. Yeah, I'm going to be shaking <laughs> she that gonna be jelly roll. She's going to be doing her thing. Yes, sir. <laughs> yes, sir. And she's going to even tell a few of them about them food stamps. <laughs>
Yeah. And what's your connection to Op Alabama Sugar? Um, Ashley Tristan, my partner. Mm -hmm. He he is he is our connection to uh, Op okay. Alabama, and I tell you, I hear that uh, that is where uh, Peggy Scott Adams is from mm. originally. Okay. That's what I was told okay. uh, by several people that uh, that that's where she was born, and she has family there. I've talked to people there that actually uh, is family related to her. Very good. So, yeah. So so. Um, you know, it's it's going to be a great time. We got uh, Mr. Campbell. For those that know uh, Mr. Campbell, he's saying that don't you want to dance? He got a line dance out mm -hmm. for that. Uh, Mobile knows it very well because that's where he's from. Mm. And then uh, we got Dave Mack. He yeah. sang them 13 days, you know. Yeah. And we also got Mr. Cynthia. Mm. You know, that's that Maxwell sound funny. Oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so, you know, he sang at Jazz and Flow on several occasions, and he sang all around the city. He was actually over at the Elk the Elks uh, a few weeks ago. Mm -hmm. uh -huh. So wow. if you like that sound, we got that sound for you. So y'all just come on out and, and support, and this is the first annual all-class reunion. Okay. So they, they want all classes. You know, there's no respective person. Just come on. If you graduated, if you was a part of any class, just come on out, and we're going to have a class roll call. You know, Alrighty. so yeah, they'll have an open about. mic and everything. So it's it's going to be an all day thing. But mm -hmm. most for the most part, it's going to be an all day thing. We just gonna have a good time. Oh, very good, very mm -hmm. good. Well, so it's gonna be. Let me let me go over the let me go over the uh, the list again. It's going to be uh, Big Yayo. This this man that doing this song here. She put her head down, you know it's about to be right. That's Big yep. Yayo, uh-huh. That's him. Yep, and then you're going to have uh, Mr. David Mack. Yep, he's going to be he gonna be there as well. Uh, mm -hmm. And folks will be, be David Mack with his 13 days. Like, and he told yep. me how he lost the love of his life. He said he couldn't eat. He couldn't sleep. All he could do was sit by the phone and wait for a call. In fact, this is what he said. People say I'm the life of the Yeah, see? That's it, that's <laughs> yeah, it, that's it. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> that's it. You're going to have Mr. Campbell there. I don't have Mr. Yeah. Campbell music, but... but, uh, but We're going to make sure you get it, brother. Yeah, make sure I get Mr. Campbell music. But we definitely going to have Miss Jelly Roll there. Yeah. <laughs> That's it. That's it. Oh, yeah. That's it. Not only she got to be jelly rolled in one, but she going to be jelly rolled in two, ain't she? That's right. That's right. <laughs> That's right. That's right. Yes, sir. We going to have a great time. Ooh, so we stamp. just inviting everybody to come on. Get those you can get them at Mr. Wings here in Pensacola. You can go uh, on the website and purchase both tickets, just general admission tickets, or you can purchase tickets for the bus at www dot southern soul music park dot com and you'll be able to print your ticket out right there bring it to the park and you are in wow. making it convenient for everybody and wow. of course you can always reach out to me or tristan my phone number is 850-296-2063 call tristan at 334-488-7742 Mm -hmm. And we'll be sure to be able to get you some tickets that way. All righty. They don't. If so you don't yeah. want to, if you don't want to drive the bus, you can just drive over if you want to. And the tickets are only twenty dollars if you drive over, right? Twenty dollars. That's yeah. right. And and let me give you the address. The address is twelve hundred one Barnes Street in Op, Alabama. That's at the Southern Soul Music Park over there. Right. And y'all gates gonna start opening at five o'clock showtime at seven. Actually, the gates are going to open prior to that. We're going to try to open up the gates at 12 because we got events that's going to be during the day. 
Um, yeah, that's right. I know, heard about yeah. I heard about y'all mm -hmm. gonna have an open mic mm -hmm. and karaoke mm -hmm. thing starting mm -hmm. at three o'clock, mm -hmm. and then you're gonna have yep. DJ Fry and Baby J yep. on the mm -hmm. ones and twos. Wow. Yeah, yeah. So you gotta have a oh, gigantic you gotta have a gigantic show. So they mm -hmm. they inviting all of the classes from everything with college classes, high mm -hmm. school classes, high about school. all well, years. Not high school now, unless you of age. Yeah. Well, <laughs> this you gotta right. be of age. Yeah, they gotta be of, well, they <laughs> when you graduate I'm gonna graduate from high school. They will be yeah. of age, sugar, when you graduated okay. from high okay. school. Well, that's that's the only yeah. graduate we ain't talking about kindergarten graduates. There you go. We talking about go. high school graduates and college and college graduates and that's that, right. that that's kind right. of stuff. That's right. Yeah. That's right. Sure is. Yeah. And so, up yeah. Alabama. If you live in that about in that round, Laverne Laverne and the Phoenix Springs and Greenville and all those places over there and and the loser, wow. Yep, yep. They're gonna, I understand you're going to start the bus off in Mobile. We're starting the bus off in Mobile. Mobile. The first pickup is at 2 o'clock. Mm -hmm. And then you're going to come Mobile. to Pensacola and then go to Fort mm -hmm. Walton Beach and then to Crestview and then on into Op, Alabama. On into Op. Mm -hmm. Wow. Yep. Now let y'all mark your calendar now. Mark your calendars for uh, October the 7th. Ms. Adner, why I got you on the phone, uh, there's another event. Okay, there's mm -hmm. another event that we're going to be celebrating that we started last year, and that's mm -hmm. the Women Against uh, Rape and Domestic Violence. We're going to have the second annual fundraiser. Can you talk to me about that? Oh, absolutely. Mm -hmm. uh, we're doing that on October the 14th. Mm -hmm. It's going to be here in Pensacola. It's going to be at the American Legion Post number 33. Mm -hmm. That's at 1401 West Intendency Street. Mm -hmm. So um, the tickets are only ten dollars uh, in advance, and they're fifteen dollars at the door. Mm -hmm. And uh, so you know, we this is an event that we we had our first one in February of this year, mm -hmm. and uh, we had to postpone that one too. But it, that's how it ended up in February. But October is our month. That's Domestic uh, Violence Awareness Month. Mm -hmm. So uh, you know, from here on out, we're trying to do something in the month of October to bring awareness. To um, you know, to, to domestic violence and sexual assault, because it's an ongoing problem. Things you know, people are being killed just like <laughs> last week or so mm -hmm. when the guy ran the, ran the car into Sacred Heart. Mm -hmm. You know, it, it's crazy. Right. It, it's it just is. crazy. And um, you know, the domestic violence has it has been going on since the beginning of time. Yeah, last you know, year, so, yeah. uh, last time we had um, Nikki Howard came to our mm -hmm. very first one. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Mickey Howard. We mm -hmm. had Jazza Drew Hill. Mm -hmm. uh, we had we had the Hog. Uh, who else? We had Raven Sauve. We mm -hmm. had Andre Williams out of Chicago, Illinois. Mm -hmm. um, who um, I know I'm missing somebody, uh, but charge it to the head and not the heart. <laughs> but uh, this year uh, we have Will Easley. He yep. has been gracious right. enough to uh, come on board with us, and it's going to be him. It's going to be Raven Sauve, of course. Um, it's going to be Centiel. Uh, Andre Williams, he's coming back. He he, um, he fell in love with Pensacola, and he loves the cause. Uh, he actually has a couple of songs out um, bringing awareness to domestic violence. So um, he, he's coming all the way from Chicago, you know, to mm. support this cause. Right. And we have the Silver Tone Summer Band. Wow. Or if anybody has ever heard them, they are a dynamic band. They play old school music. Mm -hmm. um, they, they're just like, they are a great uh, band. They're really, really great band. Um, so then, then we have uh, Lil BB. He, mm -hmm. He's coming, he has come on board. Oh, really? You got yeah. Lil BB, huh? Mm -hmm. Okay, yeah, very good. Yeah, Lil BB. He's Lil BB King. Yeah, yeah, Lil BB. <laughs> yeah. No, we yeah, he, you know, we brought him to, to Pensacola a few years ago over at the Elk. Mm -hmm. Sure did. And uh, so he, uh, we stayed in contact and he called me, what you got going on? I said, well, we doing this fundraiser for um, women against rape and domestic violence. Count me in. Mm -hmm. so, <laughs> Very good. So he, he's, he's, he's coming on. He has come on board to, you know, help help this show be a great show. And uh, it, it's a little bit different from the way it was last year. But nonetheless, we're going to have a great, great time. Mm -hmm. Great time. Great time. Right. And, you know, all of the proceeds go to support the organizations that keep their doors open 24 hours, seven days a week. 
Right. And you're also going to have yeah. Lady J on the stand. She's going to be there as well, huh? Mm-hmm. Lady J and DJ Southern Soul, they're actually yeah. going to host the show for us. Very good. Very yeah. good. Very good. Yeah, so we're right. excited. So we need to you mark know. those calendars for the February, October the 7th and 14th. We got mm-hmm. some good stuff coming up, huh? Yes, yes sir. Very yes, sir. Good. And we just appreciate, you know, can't, I'd be remiss if I didn't just appreciate um, WRNE, you know, you and yeah. Mr. Hill for the support that you guys do for the community and what you do for our organization. We just yeah. really, really and truly uh, appreciate, you know, people like you that have a heart for your community and, you know, you just do what you have to do whenever you have to do it. So yeah, we appreciate well, you. Well, thank you. No problem. We do whatever we can uh, for yeah. our community. Yeah. yeah. Okay, Sugar, well, thank you so much. And uh, just just kind of recap what we talked about, uh, folks. If you, on October the 7th, we're going to, we want you to join us at, in Op, Alabama, y'all, in Op, Alabama, for the first annual all-class reunion blues show. And they're going to run a bus trip there, too. Uh, so the tickets are going to be $45 if you go with the bus. If you go directly on your own, the tickets are only going to be $20. Also, Mark Calendar for... October the 14th, where we're going to have the second annual fundraising concert for Women Against Race and Domestic Violence at the American Legion Post Number 33, uh, featuring Will Easley and Raven Save and Andre Williams and the Silver Tone Band and Central, and going to be hosted by Lady J and DJ Southern Soul. Tickets going to be only uh, $15 at the door, but you can get them $10 in advance. Miss Edna, thank you always. You're always doing some good in the hood. Thank you, sir. All right. Only by the grace of God. All right. Thank you. <laughs> All right. We'll talk to you later. All right. All right. Appreciate it. Have All a great right. one. Okay. All right. All right. Bye-bye. All right. That's Miss Edna, y'all. Miss Edna Lachlan, the tax lady. This is her daughter, Mrs. Raven Save. Yep. She's going to be on both shows, 7th and the 14th. Let that cocoa brown. Yeah. You got me needing sweet cocoa brown. I gotta have that cocoa brown. Damn, I love in your cocoa brown. That is in your cocoa brown. That is in that cocoa brown. Ladies, I know you don't like those broke ass men, but what? Is just as bad as a broke ass man. A cheap ass man. This is TK Soul, y'all. And I see you sorry men are at it again. Messing up the plan for a good man. These independent ladies ain't trying to hear nothing. And most of all, they can't stand is a cheap ass man. A woman don't like no cheap ass man. A woman can't stand. No cheap ass man. A woman don't lie. No cheap ass man. A woman can't stand. No cheap ass man. She needs some money. Money gotta be right. Then you gotta wanna spend it on her. You can't be tight. A woman like nice things. Like diamonds and pearls. Gotta treat her like a queen. Try to give her the world. When you take her out, just be who you are. And you need to be driving a real nice car. A woman don't like no cheap ass man. A woman can't stand no cheap ass man. A woman don't like no cheap ass man. A woman can't stand. Cheap ass man Can't do with them things That you did to get up You gotta do them same things If you wanna stay with us Stop all of that lying If you don't have a home She gotta know that you're trying She'll never leave you alone If she happened to ask you To pay a bill Don't hesitate Just keep it A woman can't stand 
Messing up the plan for a good man. 